hi guys uh, welcome back to new tutorial video in this video we are going to see how to uh, configure the URDF model of your uh, robot 5 uh, into the movie uh, assistant configuration and uh, how to convert the URDF into uh, semantic robot description format and first we, uh, we need to see uh, I already cloned that URDF model of uh, your 5 robot from the github and I now I am going to show that one uh, into my Web, uh, sorry, uh, it is in my uh, workspace type cd and uh, test that is my workspace and src after this um, go to universal robot in that universal robot description uh, wait uh, uh, you were underscore description in that we have an uh, URDF right uh, go to that URDF uh, now you can see here that uh, URDF 5 dot sacro right uh, we are going to configure that file into our workspace now and now we need to launch an uh, movie assistant by using a ROS launch movie setup assistant setup dot launch it will launch the uh, on GUI right it is an uh, move it setup assistant GUI uh, we can configure our robot uh, using uh, uh, this move it uh, configuration assistant first uh, click here create a new move it configuration package click that and go to browse and I already show that uh, where is the uh, your idea of uh, file sacro file is located right uh, go to test src in that uh, universal robot uh, in that uh, ur underscore description and go to urdf in that urdf file dot sacro right click that and go to go to load the file right uh, it's showing right uh, success use the left navigation panel to the continue to continue uh, go to self collision and it is not nothing but uh, it is a pass of link or pass of join uh, we need to give the pass uh, which all are we need to configure and you can see in right side of the uh, screen that uh, you are five robot invisible robot is in uh, display and we are going to configure this into the movie configuration to the semantic robot description format and now we are going to give the self collision right uh, it's nothing but a uh, pass of link uh, go to shoulder link it will be once you click the shoulder link it will be visualized in a uh, screen right that red color and click that and go to the upper arm link and forearm link and shoulder rest rest one rest two rest three and after this uh, go to generate the collision matrix now it's successfully created right the pass of link is created for the your fire robot and go to virtual joint in this virtual joint uh, go to add a virtual joint and give some name uh, i'm going to give like a uh, virtual joint only virtual virtual underscore joint and go here that parent frame name is so uh, i am going to give the word right uh here we need to give the fixer only why means uh, the industrial robot is fixed in a uh, world frame right uh, it cannot move or play one place to another place or uh, like uh, a differential robot or um, mobile manipulators sorry a uh, mobile robots will be moved from a uh, world frame to the robot frame but uh, the robot arm or manipulator will be fixed in the world and it will be use a well frame to navigate our inverse kinematics and save it go to planning group right that planning group is nothing but uh, semantically describe the different parts of the robot and it will be and uh, used to schematically describe the different parts of your robot add all the joints using a join group 
go to add a group and give the name of your uh, joint your file underscore file and parameters file or uh, go to a uh, kinematic solver it is an uh, algorithm or an uh, kinematic solver uh, equation uh, which is based on c plus plus node uh, it will be solved the uh, inverse kinematics uh, problems using this types of algorithms which is already have a plugins to the solving the inverse kinematics uh, problems i'm going to choose a uh, kdl kinematics uh, plugin i give this uh, full explanation in my description you can go through that link and click that and go to add a uh, links uh, add a group uh, we have uh, these four types of uh, add a joints add a links add a subgroups add a chain and i am going to add a chain it will be show the parts which is an parent which is an uh, child node uh, i am going to choose uh, base link is an uh, parent link and uh, flange tool zero is an uh, child link now save it and now we created the defining the planning group our uh, base underscore link is an parent node and uh, tool zero is an uh, child node after this uh, we are to we are need to give the robot pose go to pose and add a pose i am going to give the pose name as an home position home position after giving the home position uh, we need to configure the robot to the home position uh, by uses of uh, joint state publisher uh, or an, uh, this uh, GUI to configure the home position and make it yes Yes, there we gave the home position for our robot and save it and end effector add end effector give like an I am giving the back back and give the zero to parent link is in uh, base link and parent groups in your robot save it Okay, uh, uh, in this we need not uh, here uh, active joint and passive joint. Our uh, base link is an uh, wait. Uh, we can give uh, active joints is an uh, joint which will be actively represent in the environment and passive joint which is in a fixed position, uh, not move in uh, environment. So we can give the shoulder and joined as an uh, passive join after this so uh, go to control and i already had a control go to here and give the control name as an ross and control type velocity control type save it here we save the control uh, uh, Yes, so uh, we give simulation gazebo simulation right it will be create a plugins and uh, what are things we need to simulate in gazebo will be defaultly created in the collision and uh, matrix um, sacro file will be created out uh, defaultly from the uh, movie to the assistant and after this 3d perception like uh, uh, we already put on a video right uh, 3d perception and uh, uh, in based on uh, depth camera uh, it is a camera interface or kinet interface for an uh, robot arm uh, perception uh, but uh, it is not need for uh, now and author information gave that uh, robot robot design and simulation
author information and author mail id is kabil and kb 2003 at at gmail.com and after i give this I'll go to configure the file go browse and we need to give the location of our file which is generated before this go to test 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 we already created our directory right go to test and in src and here we have need to create on folder like uh, your file new your file new and create a folder and open it now the configuration package is generated successfully right now our uh, move it assistant is uh, uh, create a successfully the uh, your idea form and we can uh, configure it by you going into the directory before that we need to make the catkin make uh, right cd test catkin make Uh, it takes some time and after make can can make we need source right uh, source or uh, devil set up dot bash it will uh, set the uh, place or workspace and go to the your audio uh, sorry your file new in that we have a launch file and configuration file in the launch file it will be automatically create uh, this much file so for uh, seeing and now we are going to launch demo.launch ross launch ross launch demo.launch Now, now it launched the always visualization software, and you can visualize the uh, your file arm in the always, and go to joints, and you can make the movement of your robot by using a joint name like uh, shoulder is you now. You can move your robot. Uh, why it is not showing right? Uh, we give that link as an. Uh, passive joint right others are the active joints uh, this is a passive joint so we cannot move that joint in the environment right and you can move any other joints from here and uh, that that declaration uh, collision uh, visualization like it have we can visualize the uh, robot arm but uh, what are the things happening what is the uh, overall thing is uh, going on will be visualized by the that uh, arrow marks collision visualization right once we move the this joint the collision visualization will be we can see in the visualization software right and uh, uh, this is a basic thing we can do and uh, after this video we are going to see how to interface and uh, 3d perception for our robot and making the some uh, c++ or python node for pick and place and open cv operations will be in upcoming videos tutorial and subscribe the channel i uh, will see in our upcoming video thank you